to make sure it doesn't fall. Where's the, there it is. There you are. I will give you $5 if you tell me why I decided to do a video looking like this. So let's just get it over with because I always do this. Wrinkles. Oh, that's nice. Connect the dots on my chin. Is anybody else like getting old and now you get zits? Okay, I just got done making my scrap room tour video. Um, it's probably going to be in two parts again like it was last time. But I just wanted to show you some things I got. I have been waiting for, excuse me, AliExpress to send me one last thing that I got. But I couldn't wait anymore because I just didn't want to wait anymore. Um, and then I also decided to sign up for the Planner Society kit. I don't know why I did that. You know why I did that? Because I saw the kit from last month and I was like, oh, that's hecka cute. And then the one that came out this month, I was like, eh. <laughs> I mean, it's cute, but anyway, so, and I probably won't show that because everybody like does nice videos of that. But the stamp that I got, I'll just show you one day, but it's really, really cool. So that's what I want to show you. So anyways, I will show you what I got. And AliExpress, um, everything is like from China or Japan, so it takes a long time. Um, but it's worth it because you pay like a doll or something. It's, well, I think the most I paid for these was, or one of them was like $2. So I got these Polaroid Deco stickers. So... And the reason I like them is because they're um, they're not glossy. They're they're what are they? They're like matte or they're like paper, but they're just cute little um, cute little stickers that you can like put in your Project Life or Traveler's Notebooks or anything like that. Planners. So I think those were like a dollar fifteen or something. And then I've never had any of these masking sticker sets. Um, I think I was. Uh, like sent in happy mail but these are nothing new but the reason I liked these ones was because they had like it's not um I think I have some that are like bright colors and stripes and everything but here let's just fan them out I'm so glad you guys weren't annoyed by my dog in that last video because he was annoying me hold on sorry I'm just gonna fan him out um he's crazy crazy okay well that wasn't very I did all of that to just show you this but it's just like ugh. I knuckle it's like newspaper or not like map and stuff like that so it's really cute and like graph paper and then these um, you probably can't see on the back no you can't but it's like strips of them and then there's like little circle stickers on the bottom so I thought they were cute so I got those and then the last thing I got came in this little tin, and they're called Kim Min Ji Edition Postcards. And she had like, oh, she had like Alice in Wonderland and different ones. But these look like little Polaroids, and they're all different, and they are so stinking krut. Krut. Let's just do this. Good Lord. So, oh, see, the lighting's not very good, but you, you get the gist of it, right? So cute. So very cute. So I have to hide these from Mila because she's gonna like try to go play cards with them or something. Um, okay, and then a local scrapbook store that I feel so bad because um no, I already showed you guys that. Another scrapbook store, Beverly's. Um, some of you might have Beverly's craft store. It's kind of like a Michaels, but they have like a lot of furniture and, and stuff like that too. Um but they are relocating. So their store was 75% off. And of course, it's like a lot of it's been picked through. But 75% um, off. I had to find something. So I just got these stickers because I don't have them. I never got anything from this line. But I did like the kind of like, not tribal. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to say. Well, it's the Happy Camper from My Mind's Eye. And it just has the... Um, stickers and the letters in them and then from illustrated faith um because i have a few things from there and there wasn't much that i wanted but i did like the the letter or the the words 
I picked up some aged gold embossing enamel. So this just, this looks like really like thick embossing enamel. Um, this is my first Memento Luxe. So I got it in a espresso truffle. Oh my gosh, speaking of espresso, the other day, I don't drink espresso, but I wanted to get my iced mocha with whipped cream because that says fancy schmancy as I get at Starbucks. Um, I used to drink decaf Americanos and then I tried to drink a real Americano. Ha, <sighs> no, because <laughs> that's like espresso and water. Anyways, the person in front of me paid for my drink. And I was like, do I got to pay for the person behind me? No, but I did. And she was like, oh, it's only, you know, it's been like a chain reaction. So I can't break the chain and be like, hey, thanks and drive off. So I paid for hers and hers was only three seventy five. dollars You know, what's really sad is that I thought, I swear, if it's like an office order and she says it's like $23, I'm bolting. Would you pay for a $23 office order? No, you wouldn't. You would say, well... That man was so nice to pay. I'm out. But I paid for hers behind me. So I'm hoping the chain went back. Pay it forward. Espresso truffle. Um, and then I got this cute little... Um, just because those guys are cute. Little dwarfs. Elves? Dwarfs? Dwarfs. Elves with no ears or mouths or noses. But they're cute. And then I grabbed some feathers, just some little multicolor feathers, and I was really excited. These were $2. And when I first saw this lady put her stamps out, I was like, I have to have them. So I got the mushroom one and the house one, I think. But they're by Stampendous. It's the Pink Your Life. These were $2. I just looked at myself. $2. So I got the cute little, again, is that an elf? Who is she? little garden girl so I got her and then I got these little Santa ones or Christmas ones but for two dollars I had to <coughs> excuse me and then I went to Joann's because everybody's like going cray over the new Heidi Swap stuff am I the only one that doesn't think that the Magnolia Jane is like it's not to die for I I like the colors but it's so like black and gray Oh, excuse me, in black and gray, and gray and black, with a little bit of pink, maybe. Um, all I wanted was the stamps that I swear are mismarked. Why are her stamps that are much bigger, $2.99, and her normal ones are $5.99, but they were all out. So, I was actually excited to see that Joann's is carrying, like, all 10, I think, of the Distress Crayons. So, I got the next one in line, the number seven. Excuse me, I think I have the first six. I don't know. So I grabbed these ones, and then there is some new Project Life stuff out. So these die cut photo frames, just these little teeny Polaroid. Let me try to put it up. Oh, oh. These little Polaroid frames, those were cute. Um, and then just this little washi from that new $1.99 section. It just has like little, it looks like little journaling cards on it. Um, got the Teresa Collins Alpha stickers and they're all gold but just different backgrounds so like marble black white and teal and then i picked this up just to try it's called irresistible it's not anything new but um i guess it's new for over there i don't know but it looks like one of those fine liners but i think it's just um to emboss it's just a really pin like a pin point or a pin top um clear so maybe I can like draw all over and then resist it. I can just like resist it. And then I saw that they had some Webster's pages and they had really cute 12 by 12 pads, the new ones. Um, but I thought to myself, all I ever do is cut those up into like Project Life cards or little teeny photos or little teeny squares. Oh, oh my gosh, <laughs> excuse me. Excuse me, I totally wolfed down and it got stuck in my chest or in my stomach. My stomach's, I had surgery, so my stomach's like up here. Um, Costco has these good spicy noodles. I'm not supposed to eat noodles, but I wolfed them down, so you're hearing that. Oh, and they have pho bowls too. Excuse me, I'm so sorry, pho bowls too. 
What the fu? Those are not good. I'm sorry. I have to pass those on to my son or something. Okay, anyways, Color Crush. So right next to it was 225 pieces of sentiment and storyteller starters. Hello. So they're all the little like, how do you do this? Well, I'm just going to do it upside down. Are they double-sided? No, they're not. But you get like three. Okay, that's really tacky. But you see what I mean. Like... It's all the, oh, all the little cut apart things. So why am I going to get a 12 by 12 pad that I probably won't use all the 12 by 12 as 12 by 12? So I got this. This is when they were 40 off and then that additional 25. And then the last, oh, you know, I had to go to Tuesday morning. And you know, I'm going tomorrow too. Because I saw somebody, gosh, you guys need to stop making videos. I saw somebody share the seven paper puffy heart and star stickers, I think. I tried to get those, what, two, three years when they came out and they were sold out everywhere. So I called my local store and there's like six of them, which means they're on the truck. It's so sad that I know that. And they're going out today. So I'm going tomorrow to get two. I know, I know. Rebel, two. That's why I'm going. I'm sure I'll find something else, but that I was so excited to see that. I was more excited to see that than those Dina Wakely brushes. So speaking of Tuesday morning, I found a distress marker storage tin and I don't know if I'm gonna put my distress markers in here. I might, but I like how I have them next to my desk now and this is like kind of bulky. Um, so I might, might put something else in here. And then I saw, there's a lot of doodle bug stuff and um, it's cute, but it's, it's even when they came out years ago, just it, I just don't think I would use a lot of it, but I did like this stamp set because it was doodly. And you know, I like my doodly things. Like I couldn't doodle my own stamp or frames, but those are cute. Then I found a pack of eight chipboard pieces for only 99 cents. And these would be good to make, um, like mini albums and stuff like that. You get four thin and four thick. I found this cute little house die. First I thought it was Christmas trees and then I was like, no, it should be houses. And it is, it says houses. So there's houses. And um, I never saw this when the Smash stuff came out. I only got the other rub-ons that were like feathers, I think, or arrows or jewels, jewels. So this big long one, but you could like cut it apart and just, rub on a few of the pieces um and then i found which is so funny because i never i didn't even touch this line because i didn't have a dog before but this was just sitting there all by itself um it's just that seven paper um i guess the dog line but it's cute i honestly i'm not trying to i'm not being mean because i have a dog I did not like animals, and not that I didn't like them, but I wasn't the type that like saw a dog and was like, oh, cute. I was like, get away from me, because I'm allergic to them. My kids are allergic to them, and we never got to have pets when we were younger. We had a hamster, but it died frozen on the wheel, like that, in the garage. My dad maybe put it in the garage. He froze on the wheel. Rude. This wasn't my fault. Um, so I've always just been like, oh, like you stink and you're slobbery. Okay. had to sit there because give me a dog and now I'm like oh, yeah, blah, 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 blah. like when I see a dog and now I want a big dog I want like a like a black mouth cur or like a bull mastiff but I'd probably sneeze my head off so where's I going with that I like dogs now I do I became I don't think I'm like a dog mom I don't know what a dog mom is but I like dogs so I was kind of excited to see this I don't know why I told it's just funny how you really don't know what it's like to have a dog until you have one. So, got that. And then the last thing I got was this big old honkin' Amy Tangerine stamp set. And I never got this when it came out because I was like, that's huge. And I would never buy that. But for $6.99, I will. So, that is it, my friends. I don't, um, yeah. The stamp I was going to get from AliExpress is their houses, and they're so cute. But the stamp set is like like this big. I didn't realize it was that big until I saw somebody actually make a video on it, and I was like, oh, God, like that's perfect for mixed media 
or art or art journaling or scrapbook pages, anything. I can't wait till it comes and I swear it better not be lost. So that's it. That is it. That's all I wanted to show you. So I'm going to upload this probably um, and then get my craft room tour going or getting it um, uploaded. So thank you so much for watching and I will check you out next time. Oh, this is what Mila would do. What is that? Oh, no. No, wait. I don't know what she does. Um, okay, bye.